I've seen this all over Instagram. Hubba hubba did he grow up to be a babe. All right, so today we're gonna show you some memes and see how well you know them. God, okay. I am not familiar with them. I'm average on memes, I guess. A while ago, I didn't know what the hell they were. And with your education, as well as the education from my kids, um, I've become quite educated, but I still think I know that much, and there's all of, this infer all of these memes out there. So, here is your first meme. I fly to the moon, I shrink the moon, I grab the moon, I sit on the toilet. Wait, what? It's a movie, I, I'm not sure what it's from. It's a, uh, uh, yeah, yeah, what's that guy? Like the evil guy from that one Pixar movie. Mm -hmm. Well, it's the minion dude, I don't know what his name is. It's, it's Steve Carell. It's from Despicable Me. I love that movie. Well, Gru looks familiar, but no, I've never seen this before. And this is how it evolved. Make them go to grade school for 12 years, then make them go to college for four to eight years. Then don't give them jobs. Then don't give them jobs. I don't understand. I like that, that's pretty good. That's why I didn't finish college. I can relate to that one. That's my life right now. My kid's getting ready to go to college in three months. I meet a nice girl at a bar and ask for her number. She gives me her number and I call the next day. I say hello and she says, Baba John, some way I help you. Oh, there's a duplicate moment. I'm on to something. Ah, uh, okay. It's a double take. Got it. You got dissed, friend. Oh, I think this one's called reality. You know, we have to be creative. If you just say no, some men out there are so just awful. I used to give out the number of the local movie theater. Reminds me back in the day when people wanted my phone number. Have you seen this meme before? I've never seen this one before, no. What's new? I don't know. The speakable me. Unspeakable me. So this meme is sometimes called Gru's plan from Despicable Me. Yes. Love Gru. Love Despicable Me. However, haven't seen the meme. I do like it though. In the movie where it came from, the last two cells don't repeat themselves, so I don't quite understand that. It's fine. I think that's the best way to put it. There's better out there. You don't love me at my worst, and you don't deserve me at my best. Okay. Okay, I seen this one. I actually really like this one. This is good. Oh, you could use this with a bajillion things. If you don't love me at my that, then you don't deserve me at my that. What's his name? Neville? This fella from Harry Potter, he got good looking, didn't he? He glowed up. Hubba hubba did he grow up to be a babe. Wow. Is that creepy? I'm so much older than him, sorry. Oh yeah, I remember seeing this one. Ooh. Ooh. You're gonna look amazing. Wow, no way. I have no idea who she is, but gee, she looks so different. Do you know this episode yes. that this is from? Sorry, I can't get over the scene. That scene in that show, that's the best. One of the best episodes. If you can take me at my, at my Andy Dwyer, then you don't deserve me at my Star Lord. Hey, Andy Dwyer can get it. One's got a six pack, one's got a little curve. One's thick, one's swole. He was cute in both though. Dad bod is actually pretty sexy. Hell to the yes. Although I deserve Star Lord. I'm just, just throwing it out there. Even as a lesbian, I don't mind looking at that. I've no problem with that. He's, that's yummy. Have you seen this meme before? I have not. I'm gonna guess. If you can't take me, you don't deserve me. It's a wild guess, I know. That one's called, then you don't deserve me. This meme is sometimes called, if you don't love me at my. You don't love me at my. Yeah, yeah, this is a good one. I thought the other one I really liked, but I, this one I love even more. Quiet Place 2018, nobody has done anything in 14 minutes. Ah, uh, it's the office guy. I see the reference to the movie A Quiet Place, and he's the actor in A Quiet Place, if I'm not mistaken. I get the reference. I get A Quiet Place, I get Jim Halpert, the director and the star of the movie, but I don't get the joke. <laughs> no notification. That's funny! It is very haunting when you don't have notifications. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Because everything's turned off, no noise, no nothing. A Quiet Place 2018, me. My joints crack, killing me instantly. Oh, oh, I see. The joints crack and then they come killing because the cracks are so loud because of his joints moving. Got it. I know, right? That's so nerve wracking. Ah, oh, that is so sad. I don't want to die like that. That's really funny, actually. That's what would happen to me. I'd be like, oh. 
Have you seen this meme before? Uh, no. I'm assuming a quiet place. It's gotta be a quiet place. It's just a wild guess on my part. So this meme gained popularity due to John Krasinski's recent movie release of A Quiet Place. Mm. Well, I gotta check it out. So good! Oh, I don't usually like scary movies. I'm big chicken. But that one, oh my god, I could not look away. Hello at TCU, come what, come all. Male privilege is a bit. Change my mind, oh God. I f hate this guy so much. It's not my place or my priority or my job to change anyone's mind about anything. I have seen this one and it's pretty funny. And this guy is a, a douchebag for thinking that male privilege is a myth. LaCroix is not good. <laughs> It actually is, especially the grapefruit. I haven't had that. I can't. I can't say whether or not it's good or bad. I haven't had Lacroix, but that's. I, I, I like this meme. Lacroix is not good. That is true. Male privilege is one thing, but now he's really messing with it. Pineapple goes on pizza. Changed my mind. <laughs> pineapple does not go on pizza. I'll change your mind by giving you a slice of pineapple pizza. It's disgusting. It does not go on pizza. And now we're gonna get into a brawl. I mean, it started with male privilege and now it's going all the way to my pizza, like, no. I don't know why people don't like pineapple on pizza. That is the only reason why I eat pizza. Pineapple does go on pizza with jalapeno. Yes, it does. Oh, that we agree upon, buddy. What I like is it's like, they're equating other really stupid stuff to this. I really like that. Have you seen this meme before? Yes, I do. I've seen this one. Change my mind. This is change my mind. And this has got to be called like change my mind. This meme is sometimes called change my mind. I like it. I didn't like the first one, but I like the rest. The smugness of the bro sitting at the table is pretty funny. It's just clowning the guy. It just means like you're just an idiot. When your knees are crying after you squat it, or the gram. I don't know what squatted for the gram means. Does that mean Instagram or grandma? Squatted for the gram? Squatted for Instagram? Oh my gosh, I've seen this all over Instagram. Once you get a certain age, you try and be gangster, but you just can't quite sometimes get back up. Me looking at the menu knowing, damn, well, I'm gonna get that same thing I always get. Shout out to my husband on that one. That's exactly what I look like. That's me every restaurant I go to. I always know I'm getting the same thing. I always know I'm getting the pork pupusas, but I'm always looking at the tamale menu. When a short man it's angry, so you gotta get down to the level and see what the issue is. Oh, no. Are they talking to Kevin Hart? This is my favorite meme that we've had. <laughs> Shout out to all the short men out there. Love y'all. Have you seen this meme before? Truth teller? I don't know. I have not seen this before, but this would be like me trying to talk sense into my child. Yeah, I have. I'm not sure what it's called. I don't know what it's called, but I've seen it everywhere. This one is sometimes called squat and stare. Squat and stare, okay. So many things you can say from just looking at a picture. That's awesome. Blue cheese <laughs> ranch. <laughs> Wrong. Blue cheese is disgusting. Whoever made that is a is a filthy liar. I'm not a ranch guy, but I know everybody else is. I despise ranch. No one should ever eat ranch. That's terrible. Carly Rae Jepsen, Mozart. Oh, who's Carly Rae Jepsen? I'm sure it's somebody that's really good that call I haven't me heard baby. of. Oh, Call Me Baby is kicking Mozart down the stairs. Mm mm. Nope. That's the wrong way. Mozart is classical music. Carly Rae Jepsen is girl pop. I don't get this. Carly Rae Jepsen is better than Mozart. Millennials. Eight bowls of cereal before bed, my summer body. <laughs> That's really good. <laughs> uh, I can relate to that one. That should just say 40, my summer body. All right, have you seen this meme before? No, I haven't, but it's funny. Kicking you down, kick down the stairs. Pretty close. This one is usually called kick down the stairs. Kick down the stairs, okay. You know, it's one picture, so the joke has to be in the writing. I wish they would show up more in my life so that I wasn't just meme educated by you guys. Like, how come nobody in my Instagram feed is cool with their memes? It's all just like food pictures. Thanks for watching Do They Know It on the React channel. Goodbye. Hey guys, Alyssa here, a producer from the React channel. Thanks so much for watching this episode today and I'm gonna show you my Gru's plan right now. You're going to watch this video. You're going to like the video. You're going to hit subscribe and click that bell to be notified for when the next episode releases. See you next time.